Assalamu alaikum. My name is Tayyiba Sayyid and I am a mom of three from Chicago. I have been a student with Rabat since 2012 uh, when they began their pilot program with the Companions class. I have um, been honored to be one of the first graduating classes in 2020 um, for the teacher certification with Rabat. And I write children's books for a living, alhamdulillah. I um, always wanted to go abroad to study. I wanted to um, spend time uh, in some type of seclusion, you know, uh, in, in like an immersion type of setting where I could just focus on sacred knowledge. And that door never opened for me. And um, after having kids, and really um, focusing on my career, I just thought that that was never going to happen. When Rabat came along, I was at a very pivotal point in my life. I had just performed Hajj. I was ready to make um, a very uh, strong spiritual change and needed some type of backing and understanding of my faith where uh, it wasn't just halal and haram. It was more of what I am able to do, what I am able to contribute and be a part of. And Rabat has um, been that opening for me to realize that I do have worth in Allah's eyes. Studying the companions first off uh, made me realize what Allah expects of me and what my potential can be. It's not stories of people who um, are not tangible they're, they're human and their lessons uh, and examples show us that we can also grow at a very quick rate. And so for me, it was such a great opportunity to be at home with my kids and be able to pursue a career and study and study uh, so deeply and from female scholars that show you your faith in such a beautiful, um, uplifting way. and. I remember one of the first things I thought after listening to uh, one of the first Rabat lectures was, that's like a breath of fresh air, where it's, it was suddenly like, I can be someone, not I suck and I'm never gonna be able to accomplish anything and I'm not worth anything. It was like, no, there's so much more that I can do for my faith. Um, but in order to do that, I have to first know my faith, and that's what Rabat has been able to open up that door <laughs> so beautifully, and then teach it to my children and my community as well.